I am absolutely freaking livid today. I have just been beyond myself for the last two hours. Now, for those of you who don't understand what, when, where, or why, let's just say Roe v. Wade has been overturned. Yeah! Mr. Trump, you're pro-life, but I, I wanna ask you specifically, do you want the court, including the justices that you will name, to overturn Roe v. Wade, which includes, in fact states, a woman's right to abortion? Well, if that would happen, because I am pro-life and I will be appointing pro-life judges, I would think that that will go back to the individual states. It was three justices named by one president, Donald Trump, who were the core of today's decision to upend the scales of justice and eliminate a fundamental right for women in this country. <laughs> There's no point in saying good morning, because it certainly is not one. This morning, the radical Supreme Court is eviscerating Americans' rights and endangering their health and safety. Today's a difficult day. The judgment coming out of the United States is an attack on women's freedom, and quite frankly, it's an attack on everyone's freedoms and rights. Oh, shut up, silly woman. I am spitting mad over this. We have six extremist justices. I am the law. Angry, because we have reached the culmination of what Republicans have been fighting for, angling for, for decades now, and we are going to fight back. They're going to cover Pocahontas, who was, think of it, think of it, she of the great tribal heritage. Getting an abortion is not easy. Making that decision is not easy. It's not something people do lightly. I'll say it again. This is not a debate or a discussion about life and death. We have had the distinct pleasure of experiencing the right wing death cult in this country during the global pandemic that has killed over a million Americans. They couldn't be bothered to put a piece of fabric on their faces temporarily, temporarily to save people's lives, to stop the spread of a lethal virus. They couldn't be bothered with that. They argued that that was too invasive. Are you serious? I hope change happens and I hope we don't keep regressing as we have been doing. Listen to what the people need and what the people want because they're currently not representing the people. I am absolutely, I'm so beyond livid at what is going on and I'm going to turn my fear into anger. I fight it! Abortion bans are illegitimate. Forced motherhood is illegitimate. We don't have any rights. We don't have autonomy over our bodies. You don't hear them saying anything about castrating men, do you? <laughs> Let it out! <laughs> Lance, Lance. Red cat.